ಶ್ರೀಮಾನ್ ವೆಂಕಟನಾಥಾರ್ಯ ಕವಿತಾರ್ಕಿಕ ಕೇಸರಿ ವೇದಾಂತ ಆಚಾರ್ಯವರಿಯುವ ಮೇ ಸನ್ನಿದತ್ತ ಸದಾ ಹೃತಿ ರಾಮಾಣುಜದಯಾಪಾತ್ರ ಜ್ಞಾನ ವೈರಾಗ್ಯಭೂಷಣ ಶ್ರೀಮತ್ ವೆಂಕಟನಾಥಾರ್ಯ ವಂದೇ ವೇದಾಂತ ದೇಶಿಕ ನೀಳಾತುಂಗಸ್ತನಗಿರಿ ಶುದ್ಧ ಮುದ್ಬೋತ್ಯ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಪಾರಾರ್ಥ್ಯ ಸ್ವಂ ಶ್ರುತಿ ಶತ ಶಿರಶ್ಧ ಮಧ್ಯಾಪಯಂತಿ ಶೋಚಿಷ್ಟಾಂ ಶಚಿಗಳಿದ ಯಾಬಲಾಕೃತ್ಯ ಭುಂಕ್ತೆ ಗೋದಾತೈ ನಮೈದಮಿ ಭೂಯ ಏವಾಸ್ತು ಭೂಯ ಅನ್ನವಯಲ್ ಪುದುವೈ ಆಂಡಾಳರಂಗರ್ಕ್ ಪನ್ನೆ ತಿರುಪ್ಪಾವೈ ಪಲ್ಪದಿಯ ಇನ್ನಿಶಯಾಲ್ ಪಾಡಿ ಕೊಡುತ್ತಾಳ್ ನರ್ ಪಾಮಾಲೈ ಪೂಮಾಲೈ ಶೂಡಿ ಕೊಡುತ್ತಾಳೈ ಚೊಲ್ಲೆ ಶೂಡಿ ಕೊಡುತ್ತ ಶುಡರ್ ಹುಡಿಯೇ ತೊಲ್ಪಾವೈ ಪಾಡಿ ಅರುಳವಲ್ಲ ಪಲ್ವಳೆಯಾಯ್ ನಾಡಿನಿ ವೆಂಕಟವರ್ಕೆನ್ನ ವಿಧಿ ಎಂದ್ರ ಇಮ್ಮಾತ್ರ ನಾಂ ಕಡವ ಅಣ್ಣಮೇ ನಲ್ಗೇ ಟುಡೇಸ್ ಪಾಸುರಂ ಇಸ್ ದ ಲೆವೆಂತ್ ಪಾಸುರಂ ಆಫ್ ತ್ರಿಪಾವೈ ದಿಸ್ ಪಾಸುರಂ ಆಂಡಾಳ್ ವೇಕ್ಸ್ ಅಪ್ ಎ ಗರ್ಲ್ ಹೂ ಇಸ್ ಸಪೋಸ್ ಟು ಬಿ ಉತ್ತಮ ಅಧಿಕಾರಿ ಊರಕ್ಕೆ ಒರು ಪೆಣ್ ಪಿಳ್ಳಾಯ್ ಶಿ ಬಿಲಾಂಗ್ಸ್ ಟು ದ ನೋಬಲ್ ಲೀನಿಯೇಜ್ ಶಿ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ಬಿಲಾಂಗ್ಸ್ ಟು ಅ ರಿಚ್ ಫ್ಯಾಮಿಲಿ ಎ ಗೋಪಿ ನೋನ್ ಫಾರ್ ಹರ್ ಎಕ್ಸ್ಟಿಂಗ್ವಿಸ್ಟ್ very very a very wonderful lineage and our relatives are known well for the way in which they they perform their daily duties of the cowherd folks so these duties means milking the cows etc now here after the birth of kannan it is believed that even the old cattle looked younger they became younger it is also told that king dasharatha after rama was born he found himself young such is the effect of one's associations with parman he keeps us energetic he keeps us younger agile dynamic so it is difficult to keep count of the cattle individually it's also difficult to keep track of them in groups also taking this advantage even the devatas the demigods they all descended on the earth in the form of cattle in the form of cows and calves so that they can associate themselves with lord krishna so kannan is popularly addressed as the master cowherd boy who milked the entire herd so they would not they 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 would not even bother about counting the cowherds would not continue with their trading of milk and ghee they followed their practice of milking the cows only to free them of their burden from the udder they were determined to fight the offenders like kamsa and the other asuras who come to come and dare touch upon their darling krishna they would not harm one who had put their weapon down they are so blemishless that is why this pasuram katrik karavai kanangal palakarande shetrar tiralaliya shendri sherichayum kutramonrillada kovalar குற்றமொன்றில்லாத கோவலர்த்தம் பொற்கொடியே புற்றரவல்கோல் புனமையிலே போதராய் சுற்றத்து தோழிமார் எல்லாரும் வந்து நின் முற்றம் புகுந்து முகில் வண்ணன் பேர்பாட சிற்றாதே பேசாதே செல்வ பெண்டாட்டி நீ எற்றுக்கு உறங்கும் பொருளேலோர் எம்பாவாய் ஹியர் தே ஆர் த த கேர்ள் பிலாங்ஸ் டு த லீனியேஜ் ஹூ ஆர் டேக்கிங் கேர் ஆஃப் கண்ணன் who fight the offenders like kamsa and the other asuras who dare touch upon the glory of kannan they would not harm who put their weapons down they are so blemishless they were akin to rama and showed the magnanimity of allowing their enemies to retire and come back the next day indru poi naalai va like that they let their enemies if they keep their weapon down they let them go scot free andal continues addressing one of her friends oh illustrious 
So Andal addresses this Uttama Adhigari and says, O Purkodiye, O golden creeper of a girl, you are the gem among the group. You are a jewel among the cowherds because you, your group is a master in the milking of so many groups of young cows at a stretch. Katrik Karavai Kanangal Palakarandi Shetrar. Second, they are skillful. Shetrar Tiralaya Shendri Sherichayu. They are skillful in warfare. They are very much able to go against and destroy their enemies and completely rout their strength. And three, they are blemishless, they are faultless. So, you belong to such wonderful lineage who are master craftsmen, who go against their enemies and destroy them, and they are blemishless as well. Oh, charming peacock-like beautiful girl with the, with the waist resembling the hood of a cobra, Putchara Valhul Ponamayile, Podarai, please come and join our gang. We and our friends have come and entered your front yard, the mutram of your house, and we are singing the names of the Lord, the names of the Lord who is dark, dark hued color. Why are you fast asleep still without you and moving, without giving any response? Why do you do that? So here, Andal asks. So the maid asks from inside, have the others joined you? And Andal says, you very well know that the entire group of higher party is at your doorstep, your backyard. Why did you choose mine? She asked. The place is reserved only for Kannan when he comes to meet me. Andal replies, it is indeed to sing the divine names of Kannan, who has the who has the color like a rain-bearing cloud, and who is the object of your delight. Having heard this Kannan and dark blue-hued color, she got ecstasy. Immediately she became she immersed herself in Kannan's glory and withdrew herself back to her bed without taking, without without bothering that they are waiting. So Andal says, you are his favorite spouse, wife. Your heart is now filled with the bliss of having heard the Kannan's divine glory and you have immersed yourself in his Kalyana Gunams. It would be our fortune if, we, if you join our gang. You have gone back to sleep. Why? The greatest bliss is to join the group of Bhagavatas, is to join the group of the Lord's servants. Why are you acting like a recluse in a, in a self-experience? Consider our desperate request, prayer, plea, and at the same time, overlooking the possibility of wonderful fortune of joining with Kannan along with us. So what, what's the inner meaning of this? The Acharyas, who are like the cattle, impart the milk of divine jnanam to the disciples, to the Sishyas, who are like the calves. Wealth does not join a Jeevan in a spiritual journey. Riches will not join our journey. It only bestows momentary material pleasure. The divine names of the Lord, on the other hand, give us the eternal blissful nature. So, this is what is the inner meaning. However, Katrik Karavai Kanangal Palakarande, having drunk the milk of Jnanam from all Upanishads, Smriti, Itihasa Puranams, independent of their size or complexity, Shetra or Tiralaya Shendri Sherit Chayum, having won over the Yethis and, and, and bring transform them into astika abhimanis in the sastric sadas in a vidvat sadas kutramundrilla the kovalartam purkodiye the sat sishyan who has been blessed with the sadacharyan with mastery over the blemishless vedas he is the purkodi the sat sishyan who has been blessed with the sadacharyan 
with mastery over the blemishless faultless vedas punamayile wo satshishya who dances like a peacock while singing the divine names of the lord when when the satshishyan listens to the name of the lord he jumps with joy and dances like the peacock podarai may you be engaged in this ananda anubhavam may you be joining us the bhagavata goshti sutrattu tholimar ellarum vande the the adivaikas who display friendship to you the prapannan have come now the adivaikas who display their their amicable nature to a prapannan to the sharanagatan have all come and they are ready nin muttram pugunde they have entered the front gates of your body and entered into your sukshma shariram the adivaikars mugilvannan per paada they are reciting the divine lords names they are ready to lead you to his supreme abode sri vaikuntham through the archiradi margam like the bhagavatas reciting mantrams karana mantrams the charma shlokam into your ear shitrade peshade selva pendati shitrade you should you should cast away any concern about committing papams consciously or otherwise you should not worry about the papam that you have been committing unintentionally or intentionally pesade you should you should not speak of anything other than bhagavan namas ni selva pendati you are the one appreciated by lord himself you are his darling you are his spouse you are his, you, you, he is waiting for you நீ செல்வ பெண்டாட்டி உறங்கும் பொருள் எதுக்கு எட்டுக்கு யூ ஹாவ் நோ மோர் கர்ம வினா யூ ஹாவ் நோ மோர் கார்மிக் டிசீஸ் டு வரி அபவுட் ஒய் யூ ஆர் ஸ்டில் டீப் ரூட்டட் இன் த சம்சாரம் ஒய் யூ ஆர் டெல்யூடட் இன் திஸ் பிரமை ஸோ சச் அ பியூட்டிஃபுல் மேனர் ஹி சேஸ் கோவலர்தம் பொற்கொடியே புற்றரவல்கள் புனமயிலே செல்வ பெண்டாட்டி this three identification suggests that this gopi is like a dependent creeper on the supporting rod of acharyan and is distinguished for her fragrance of paratantriya so she is uttama adhikari such a beautiful manner here punamayile the acharya says the, the they compare the equivalent of a peacock to the sadacharyan the poisonous insects would stay away from the peacock for fear of their lives similarly acharyas through their glories through their vaibhavam chase away all anishtams all all wrong evil things so acharyan thus will exhibit their jnana vikasham when they experience a sat shishyan sutrat tholimar ellarum vande atma and deha bandhus will flock around mahans one can see that whatever was with embar mudaliyandan who are deha bandhus and kuratthalwan kidambiyachan who are atma bandhus serving him shitrade peshade andals pasura vilakkam has the echo of swami nammalvas thiruvaimali shitravenda chindi peya mum kandir halanto so i have i so here i have nothing else to say to you the people of the world and i have said everything briefly for all beings in this vast universe without any need for exertion or exercise so here here it's all the lord krishna was born in mathura to protect the cows almost as their mother his his vatsalyam his simplicity his similar qualities are all flaws flawless they are a pleasure to think about contemplate so this is the easiest and practicable way of life dr v n vedanta desikan writes about the tiruvaimali line so karavaigal are the acharyas who yield abundant milk of gnanam so katr karavaigal acharyas with abundant wealth of shishyas pala karante acharyas who have absorbed from many sources many many subjects many purvacharyas bahubhya srotavyam bahuta srotavyam 
they store them for the benefit of several shishyas shetrar veda bahyar kudrushtis the non vaidika avaidika matams who do not accept vedam as pramanam or those who misinterpret vedam for their benefit shetrar tiralaliya chendri going on dig vijayam vijay yatras they defeat the views of veda bahyas kudrushtis to establish the parama vaidika matam the sri vishishta advaita sri vaishnava madam on its solid footing kutram ondrillada kovalar these acharyas engage in the blemishless act of spreading sat sampradayam by defeating the views of veda bahyas and kutrushtis they do it not because of ahankaram amakaram but do it out of vatsalyam for the future generation to spread the true meanings of tattva hita purushartham kovalartham pur kodiye that beautiful golden creeper which survives through supporting itself on such kovalar these acharyas are like the are like the stick and the shishyas are like the kodi the creeper who who are supported by the acharyas so this uttama adhigari will sing and dance like a joyous peacock with bhagavad anubhavam because chitrade pesade because of humility and freedom from ahankara mamakaram the uttama adhigari says stays motionless without speaking he is full of bhagavad anubhavam enjoying silently and contemplating on perumal's glories yetrikku urangum porul you uttama adhigari you are a prapannan you are a sharanagatan you are our great wealth your arulichayal is our property how can can one who is both wealth and property sleep please join us and remove the guna doshams in our anubhavam you should join us and guide us says andal andal trividigale sharanam kavitarkik simhaya kalyana gunashalini shrimate venkatesaya vedanta gurave namaha dhanyosme